Hello, YouTube. This is uh, totally unrehearsed. I'm going to show you guys how Sicilians eat apples. First of all, we have a Granny Smith, and it's got this tag on it that tells you Monsanto has fucked it up with toxic waste. We all know that. You know, uh, this is how my grandfather ate apples. This is how my father ate apples. This is how I eat apples. I don't know if my brothers eat apples this way. I always thought Sicilians always ate apples like this, with a knife. This is my CRKT swindle. Ken Onion design. I watched my grandfather do this. I watched my father do this. Kind of dusty. There's a story. I wasn't there. Damn it! How poverty can imprison a young man. When my grandfather died at his funeral, apparently before they closed the casket up, my father put a big red delicious apple in his casket. That's how important apples were to my grandfather. My father ate them all his life with the knife, and I do the same thing. So, um, I always peel them. Uh, I don't know why, because I like using a knife, or I peel them because that's where all the sprayed on toxins are. I just peel them. See, look at these beautiful sections. I don't quarter them, I cut them into six pieces. And uh, it's a healthy snack, huh? You know, I usually like all my fruit room temperature. But uh, these Granny Smiths, I have found, if you refrigerate them, and I do, they remain wicked crisp. Just crisp. They don't go mush and mush on you. They just uh, really almost done here. See, these saucers are black Fiesta Ware, designed by Homer Laughlin. Laughlin for your Fiesta Ware fans, and I am wearing Versace. Okay, here we go. Put this more center frame. I usually uh, wipe my blade more often when I'm cutting citrus. Well, this isn't citrus, is it? It's an apple. What a nice knife, huh? You saw how it made short work of that? I close her up, put her down here where you can watch, and you can listen to me chew. Just one. Okay? Well... My grandfather was an immigrant. He was so happy to be in this country. He loved it so much. He'd hold up an apple. Big, red, delicious apple. And he'd hold it up and he'd say, God bless this country. They don't grow fruit like this in Europe. He loved it here. To him, America was nothing but abundance. And Sicily was nothing but poverty. All right. Thanks for watching. You don't have to hear me chew anymore. God bless you. I love you all. Thank God for all his abundances. Bye-bye.